Hello everyone, and I'm here to announce the lo uh, meeting location for the Leon Valley event coming this Saturday on July 21st. As is, we're going to go ahead and meet up over at the Ingram, uh, in Ingram Transit Center over by uh, Wasbach Road and Ingram Road. It's right next to Ingram Park Mall, just off the 410. Now, the thing is, the, the great benefit about meeting up at this location is there's plenty of parking. It's outside of Leon Valley, so if there's a, an issue of arrest, the likelihood of vehicles being towed is going to be pretty much near nay, uh, nay of happening for the most part. And as you can see, there's plenty of parking within the uh, the transit uh, center parking lot here for uh, Parker Ride. And of course, there's parking over here and then parking here and parking over here at the mall galore so there shouldn't be an issue of parking if uh there sh ends up being like 300 people that show up and as is with the transit center there is a bus line that runs into leon valley so depending on where we end up ending it at or if you want to leave early uh because from what i've been told that uh we have uh we might end up at Leon Valley. We might end up at a community center over here where they're holding the work event uh, or the workshop. And I think also the meet and greet, which is actually happening right before us showing up at the at the designated location, uh, probably will be happening there. For, for the most part, you'll be able to catch a bus ride back to your vehicle. Uh, we'll try to have people that are going to be ferrying people back and forth logistics wise for those that aren't able to uh, get over there and all that stuff. And so we're trying to make sure we have everything covered in that spot uh, in those regards. Now, I also want to point out that uh, I'm not going to be there physically myself. Uh, unfortunately, the GoFundMe, I don't just not enough money got put into it. I will try to refund those that have put money into go uh into the gofundme on that part i will see see about trying to be present in an other aspect either through uh watching through live streams or uh even calling in and maybe uh making a speech or something like that uh, that's still up in the air on how that's going to be handled now i just want to point out a few things for you guys that will be in uh there try to keep it civil please um as is Present yourself like you'd be presenting yourself in front of a jury while doing this event. Leon Valley has been known for arresting people and trying to charge them for stuff, laws that they never broke. Uh, a good example was the blocking the uh, entryway incident happened in uh, several weeks back. Uh, so just keep in mind, try to keep that. Uh, you don't know if you're going to have to take that to court. So we don't want to have our, uh, obviously, uh, attendees at this rally uh, being arrested, but should uh, the unlikelihood of that happen, we want to make sure you have the best odds at beating whatever they try to throw at you. And if you have, if it's egregious enough, and you're wanting to pursue civil cases, we want to make sure you have a good chance of pushing a civil case back if some uh, if it goes that far. Um, also, keep in mind it's going to be really hot. It's going to be uh, it, by the afternoon time frame. It's going to be over 100 degrees. By noon, according to the weather estimates, it's going to be over 90 degrees. Dress ready, uh, preferably for the heat. That bring a hat or some sort of something that will sort of shade you. Sunscreen, sunblock is going to be very helpful. I recommend also. I mean, t-shirts are. I mean, a large t-shirt can be really handy on hot days. It'll cover up a good portion of your skin, but also give you breathing room and all that stuff. A cotton t-shirt, a polyester, um, and keep hydrated. But also keep in mind, don't overhydrate yourself and drain yourself of salt. Uh, make sure you keep that uh, in mind uh, for those that have a tendency to drink a lot of water when it's hot out. Um, another big important thing, it's been no secret, Open Carry Texas uh, members are wanting to show up and show their support. And we are, Nair is glad to have them with us and showing their solidarity with what's going on in Leon Valley. There will be open carry, at least from open carry Texas members. If you want to have a chance to uh, experience uh, open carry yourself, this would be a good event. Make sure you're legal to do so yourself. And I'm pretty sure open carry Texas members will be more than happy to inform you about your legal rights uh, while uh, uh, while open carrying during this event and 
help watch out for you if you ask for it. So be cordial with them. They're really great people more, uh, more often than not. I've had great conversation with various members of Open Carry Texas. Um, we've had a great working relationship, especially when we worked with Almost Park. And the last thing I want to point out, and most importantly, enjoy yourselves and have some fun. So uh, this is not just, I mean, show, serious, we've got to be all serious and down and all that stuff. Enjoy yourself. Socialize. There's going to be, there's a nice uh, park area right here next to uh, uh, the city, uh, city hall right here and the conference center. So you can enjoy yourselves uh, sitting, I mean, they got a nice little walking trail there and I think they got uh, maybe bring a basketball. I think they did they have a basketball court? No. Uh, they, yeah, they do got a basketball court. So I mean, maybe you can take a break uh, in between or whatever and uh, the locations and uh, play some basketball. Uh, use this as a good day to get out, and enjoy yourselves, exercise your rights, show your solidarity, saying, "Hey, yeah, we don't like what Leon Valley is doing in violating people's rights," and uh, work together and showing all that stuff. Now, as I said, I won't be present, but I'll try to be there in spirit, uh, at least uh, through the live streams. And as I said, I, I, if I can work it out, I'll uh, maybe uh, do a call in. We still got to work out a few minor logistical issues on that other part there. So that one's still up in the air if I'll, I'll uh, uh, call in and do a speech. Um, if anybody's got possibly a megaphone that that uh, we might be able to borrow that would be very handy if you could bring that along so just putting that out there that would be sort of the limiting factor uh talking into a phone and then having it come out loud enough where everybody can hear you so anyway you guys that are going to be present i hope uh to see you there through the live streams or at least the uh, the videos that come afterwards enjoy yourselves have fun and uh have a good day